It is. It is. We expect to see uh, clearing skies. We should see sunny skies by the time we hit our high temperatures, and they will definitely be a lot hotter than what we had yesterday, especially when you factor in the humidity. So we're taking a live look outside. Eh, still got some clouds out there this morning uh, for some, but generally speaking, it's a lot clearer than it was this time yesterday. Currently 73 degrees on our way to a high of 88 degrees. So we were at 84 degrees on Sunday yesterday, only 81 degrees, but I think a nice little break if uh, heat and humidity have not been your thing. It was still a little muggy yesterday, but we had a lot of cloud cover. For some, we had some rain. Today, we're expecting the heat, the sunshine, and the humidity. It will be a little bit sticky today. Same for tomorrow. Today, you don't won't really need your umbrella, but tomorrow, it looks like things are going to be pretty active for Wednesday. So let's take a look at your SkyCast satellite and radar. I think you can make out that, you know, there's not much going on at the moment, and we kind of expect it to stay that way throughout the day as higher pressure builds in. So the setup is this, the cold front that moved through here over the weekend well offshore, uh, the area of low pressure associated with it to the north has obviously moved as well. So higher pressure is building in. We really do expect fairly quiet conditions today as we turn on your future cast. The only thing it really shows us, a little bit of cloud cover as we head through the afternoon, that's pretty much it. And it's not until tonight that we start to see a chance for some shower activity, maybe a thunderstorm, but that is well north of New York City. So Sullivan, Ulster, and probably Duchess as that moves along, uh, that would be for you. But for the rest of us, it looks like things will probably stay dry today. Tomorrow is when things get active, and that could start early in the morning. We could see a little bit of activity as we head into the afternoon, some shower and thunderstorm activity, and that could linger into the e uh, late afternoon and evening hours. So tomorrow looks like the day that you'll definitely want to grab that rain gear. Any of the thunderstorms that do develop tomorrow do have at least a slight potential to be severe to marginal risk for most of the uh, tri-state area. So that is a little bit uh, more than your garden variety thunderstorm. So it's a possibility that we could see that. But again, that's tomorrow. As far as how much rain we get, well, I would say not much. For some, you know, maybe a quarter of an inch to a half an inch. But I would say it doesn't look like at this point anybody will see more than an inch of rain, which honestly is a good thing. Because remember, we went from seven to four. We have the fourth wettest July on record with just over nine inches of rain so far this month. Month is not over. We don't really need more rain. So that is uh, hopefully we can stay put. Right now, today, though, we're talking about the sunshine and the humidity. So sunny, 88 degrees, but when you factor in that humidity, it will feel like the low 90s. That's what you want to dress and prepare for as you move around today. Mary, Cindy, Elise, thank you.